Well, it's Halloween, but it's still Taco Tuesday. We're going to check in with Charles Kelly right now, who's standing by with Compadre's food truck. How you doing, Charles? Are you freezing out there? You got frozen tacos yet? <laughs> Hi, Salentia. Happy Halloween and happy Taco Tuesday. We're, we're keeping warm out here with the taco truck. I'm here with Porfirio Rodriguez, the owner of the Compadres Food Truck. Thanks for joining us today. So you said you also own a restaurant associated with the food truck. Yes, we are. So we have a, a restaurant, the Fiesta Cafe Bar, and also we have the uh, food truck, the Compadres. And where are you guys usually parked out to serve people? Okay, so for the food truck, we always park at the 37 and 18 Avenue here in Rochester, Northwest. Now it's pretty chilly, so let's take a look inside the food truck. Come so on, take us on inside. Come on, All right. take us in. All right, so now what are some of the popular items that you serve people um, here? So uh, yes, we do. Uh, we do sell a lot of the obviously the tacos. That's the main plate here, here at the food truck. But also that it's coming be popular the uh, quesadilla. So we have really nice quesadilla too. Uh, as far as for the meat, uh, the barbacoa. That's the uh, shorty, uh, shorty beef uh, uh, barbacoa. That's what that's really really popular now. And you said you're gonna make something for us right now, so we can kind of oh, see yeah. you in action. Oh yeah, yeah. We're gonna make a, a really cool taco. Okay. All right. So tell us. How how you're gonna start okay so we'll put our gloves right now and then uh, we're gonna heat up our tortilla right now and then we'll put the uh, meat we're gonna do the shorty shorty beef okay and what's the most popular item that people usually buy uh, the most uh, the most popular they buy the uh, uh, like I said the uh, right now the tacos and getting getting popular the quesadilla with the barbacoa okay, okay. so we'll do um, we'll use a little oil here at the at here and then we'll put a little bit on the top too and um, so this is a corn tortilla so all right and uh, you said now this is gonna be your first year that you're gonna stay open through the winter oh yes yes yeah so we've been uh, doing this for five years and then we never opened the uh, uh, on the winter so for this year we're gonna try and we'll see how they go so we want to appreciate it to all those customers that have been support us uh, for the five years okay but it stays nice and warm in here at least through the winter time it's it's pretty nice and toasty in here at least Lentia. <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> okay so here's you can see the tortilla now that's hot mm -hmm. and then we'll put the meat right now so you can see it's really juicy too and do you make this all in your restaurant and then yes. bring it on? Yes, this is everything is fresh. We are making at the restaurant. So, all right, and this is all the toppings. So we do the uh, um, cilantro. We do the, I'm sorry, the, uh, this is the onions and we do the cilantro. And then we do on the top the cheese. So, so this is how we make the street tacos. They call the street tacos here in, in Rochester. Awesome. Thank right. you so much for no. joining us. This thank looks delicious. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. And a lot of the people here are loving it. All right. Back to you, Salentia. Thanks, Charles. It looks good. Don't freeze out there. <laughs> well, coming back after the break, we're going to talk about the telethon that's coming up. There's auditions going on. And uh, yeah, you can still be a part of it. We'll be right back after the break. <laughs> 